What I want to show you here is how I created this trout graphic. Um, first, let me show you what a brook trout looks like. So you'll see it's got a lot of cool patterns on the fins and on the body. And I thought this would be a good place to use the Nature Tones brushes. So this design, if you wanted to download it, it's available in the new Aventura collection. But if you like drawing and you have the Procreate app for iPad, you can use some brushes I offer called Nature Tones. And let me show you a few of these. So if you actually turn off these layers I have here with the textures in them, you'll see how the, you know, the graphic looks good, but it looks maybe a little bit flat. But if you add some texture, it's just gonna give your design a little bit extra pop to it. And you can actually emulate those textures on the brook trout pretty well. I didn't really plan this. You know, these uh, textures were inspired by nature, but they, they weren't meant to emulate a brook trout. But um, I'll just show you a little bit how I uh, use these textures. This one with the, the red part the, is, it's a chameleon texture. And if you paint in lightly, you'll get that. And if you add a little more pressure, you'll get a little bit thicker pattern. But what you can also do is you can go in here and just change the brightness. Like if you wanted this texture to be lighter, you can actually push down the brightness of it. And you'll see when I go back, you have even more room to play with, with kind of how thick this texture is. And these are also pressure sensitive. So if I add pressure, it'll thicken them up a little bit, but you can kind of, you have two ways to, to mess with these with the brightness and the pressure. So if I go the other way on the slider, it'll thicken right up. So you get a nice gradient with these. Um, same thing with this texture, this yellow part. Let's see, that was the, oh, that was a reptile texture. And here again, you can go into grain, turn down your brightness, and if it's, if it's up, it'll look more like a reptile texture. And if it's down, it looks more like scales or the dots on a brook trout. So that's how I got that yellow part right there. And then up here, I think that was just the basic coral. So again, if you go in here, go into grain, go into brightness, turn it down. You can start out with you know, just changes to black. You can start out with just kind of a light texture and you can add pressure. And if you still want more, just go back in there to grain, turn your brightness up and you can thicken up that texture. So those are the Nature Tones brushes and the trout is in the Aventura collection. Thanks for watching.